My wife and I have spent the last week or so power washing the patio. Every year our patio gets more and more black lichen and black spots on it. So this year I've decided to try and do something about it because it was getting that bad that it was starting to look awful. I'm using sodium hypochlorite. Sodium hypochlorite is basically household bleach but this is very strong, it's at 15%. And the stuff you buy in the bottles is usually 2-3%, something like that. So it's 5-7 to seven times stronger than normal. I'm using just less than a 50% solution. So I'm using this sprayer to put the solution on. I've got graduated marks on the side there. So initially I put five liters of hypochlorite in and then I took it up to about nine liters with water and then mixed it. I've still got about two liters left in there. This is what sections of the patio look like before I do it. And as you can see, if I bring the camera around here, this bit I've already sprayed. It's a warm sunny day today and I thought that the stuff would evaporate before it could work but that is not the case. It is working very quickly. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to finish the 9 litres and we'll see how far 9 litres goes. Now this is a 25 litre drum of 15% sodium hypochlorite and I paid £28 for it. If you're going to attempt to do this please make sure that you don't wear any decent clothes because it will absolutely ruin them. So I'm not going mad with the spraying, I'm just making sure that the areas that I'm spraying are wet. Putting a little bit more on the areas where there's a lot of lichen and black spots. But I'm actually spraying every stone because it bleaches the stone and if you don't do it all, then you'll have areas of the patio that are a different colour to the rest. And you've got to do all the slabs. And as you can see it's fairly quick, it's not arduous in any way. You can smell the bleach and you mustn't do this in a confined area. Now I've tried this on the bit of the patio that's below here and it worked a treat. So the only thing difference was that I put that on with a brush and I'm putting this on obviously with a backpack sprayer and the sprayer is much much easier. A sprayer is the way to go. So I'll leave the camera on this slab while I spray it and you can see what happens because things happen really quickly. So that's it sprayed. I'll put a little bit more on than I normally do on there but never mind. Now you can see it's beginning to act already. It acts almost instantly when you put it on. So, and it'll start bubbling where it's oxidising on the organic matter that's there. Look at the difference that's just made in you know, 20 or 30 seconds. I'm not sure how long it is, but look how quick it acts. Right, so that's me reaching the end. So that's nine litres of solution, which is five litres of sodium hypochlorite. And it's done, obviously from there, to where the gate's going across, or the brick wall in the far side there. Now I'll walk down with this and you can have a look at it. And as you can see, we've still got a little bit of black spot left in areas. And if I go back to these stones, you can see the difference, look as I'm walking along. So it is a very effective way of getting rid of lichen and black spot. So I'm going to mix another batch now. So I'm finding it really difficult to see but I've put just over 5 litres in there now of sodium hypochlorite and I'm going to take it to about 9 litres just below the 10 with water now. So that's about 9 litres and that's roughly where I mixed it to before. So you can see it's not an awful lot and it's done a fairly large area. And I was lucky enough not to spill any of the sodium hypochlorite onto the sprayer. If you do, you need to rinse it off, but I managed to pour that without any incidents. Right, so I'm going to continue spraying now until I finish the patio. Right, so that's it finished. That's the entire patio sprayed. Don't know whether you can see that. I've got about two litres of solution left. So I've used 16 litres of solution. So that's a grand total of just under nine litres of 15% sodium hypochlorite. So seeing as I've got two litres of solution left, I'm gonna run around now 
and just go over any bits of black spot that are left. Areas like that. So it's now virtually all dry and after looking around the patio I'm happy with it. So what I'm going to do now is rinse everything off with a high pressure water jet. I'm not actually going to high pressure water jet the patio. The plan is to just rinse it off so that it can dry and then I can let the pets back on the patio. So it's mid afternoon now. I've been around with a water jet, cleared everything up and it is looking infinitely better than it did before I started. So I'm going to just leave it like that I think and then maybe do the same thing next year. Much much better, very easy and fairly cheap to do. Anyway I hope you found this useful and thank you for watching.